Let's play some Monster Hunter. Monster Hunter. Give me one second. Make sure everything's good. Looks like it. All right. We Gucci. Just gonna do some like. Uh. Oh no. Any quests? Hey, what's up, Loki? Yes, blindfold. Uh, evening star, I'll do that. I'll do some Alatrion. <laughs> Let me put my blindfold on. All right, there we go. What's up, dads? How's it going? How are you doing? We think elemental weapons should be able to shut down Alatreon's powers. Yeah, yeah. Let's fuck him up. Let's fuck him up. Oh god. <laughs> Uh, let's finish your stream, uh, and some Cosmos player. Nice! Hope you had a good stream. Um, I always forget to Our fucking, waiting, a big attack. Get your healing items ready. um, to lurk in somebody's channel. I always forget that, I'm sorry. But yeah, I hope you had a good stream. Be able to figure out which elements are effective. Your oh. Have status, so Gotta take a no, Barry. You, got you forget too, yeah. It's cause this this isn't my main Twitch account that I watch people on. I watch my like people on another account. Uh but yeah. <laughs> Makes sense, yeah. Oh shit. I'm just getting hit left and right here. I haven't played Call of Duty in like so long. It's been so long since I've played Call of Duty. I think my last one was like Black Ops. Like one. Nice. 
I need a null berry. Of course. This Alatrion's getting uh, beat down. <laughs> Bully beat down. Okay. You never played Monster Hunter? It's really fun. It's really fun. It's my favorite game ever. Monster Hunter World. I mean, you just kill giant dragons and stuff. You know. Kill giant dragons. Make armor and weapons. There's like 14 different weapon types. So there's like there's like bows, bow guns, there's swords, you know, stuff like that, hammers. But yeah, this game's really fun. Um, Monster Hunter is my favorite series ever. And there's a new Monster Hunter game coming out next year, but I'm looking forward to that. Single player games for too long get bored quick. Oh yeah. Yeah, I mean, you c this is multiplayer. Like I was playing with four people in that hunt. Um. You can play with uh, up to four people per hunt, you know, outside of LEGO Star Wars games. <laughs> nice. You, yeah, I mean, um, single player games are for everybody. Same thing with multiplayer games, they aren't for everybody, so I understand. But the LEGO games, <laughs> the LEGO games are where it's at. I beat uh, LEGO Jurassic World uh, like a couple months ago. It's pretty fun. Yeah, so it's really okay. You can make lobbies in this game of 16 people. So if I want to like go to online session, I could create an online session and it has up to 16 people that can join. <laughs> Got Lego problems. <laughs> Don't we all? Don't we all? But you can also join a quest and respond to an SOS. And it'll just drop you into a hunt that somebody else is in. Um, so I'm going to go into this one. So it's really quick and easy to just jump into a multiplayer hunt. You can do this whole game solo. You can do it the whole game with another person. You know, other people. Um, yeah. I got Lego problems too. I have, I have like IRL Lego problems. <laughs> I buy a lot of uh, Legos. Mostly Lego Minecraft, but I've tried to stop. But yeah. This is another player. They're just standing there. You too. Dude, Legos... I don't know. They're so fun to build. But once I build them, they just kind of sit there. 
and collect dust. Lego Star Wars? Really? Nice. I used to collect Lego Star Wars. I had a lot of the older ones. Um, it was like that giant droid. It was like a brown, huge droid thing I, that like carried droids. I forgot what it's called, but you flip Lego on the side. Nice. You have, you have a Bricklink store. Is it like the same as your uh, Twitch name? The MTT. I have no idea the name. Oh my god. I'll have to check that out. Oops, I got the wrong equipment. I'm dead. Oh my god. Yeah, paste the link. I'll check it out later. Nice. I'll check that out later. I'm getting dunked on. Oh god. I collected Lego Star Wars and Lego um, Power Miners, I think it's called. I like that set. Uh, complete sets of individual figs. Power miners, yeah. I fucking love power miners. Yeah, hell yeah. I had like every single one in the set. Because there wasn't that many. But like Lego has become so crazy expensive, it's insane. One collection you mean to get? Nice. Sadly, I I think I gave them all away. I don't know what happened to them. Yeah, they get pricey. Oh my god. Going into the wall. Oh, you fucking. Alright, whatever. Yeah, I can't support financially Legos anymore. It's way too much. Rip, yes. <laughs> This is like one of the hardest bosses in the game, so people don't know, really know how to fight uh, this boss. Uh, Mom gave my legs away when I went to college. Yeah, pretty much. Pretty much. Pretty much when I moved out. Sadly. Um. Oh shit. Speaking of people who don't know how to play this. Yeah, I also had a lot of connects. I had like connects roller coasters and shit. And uh I still have an amiibo collection. I have most of the amiibos in box and Skylanders. Connects, yeah. They just like disappeared off the market. Crazy. Come on. Okay. Nah, connects are awesome. 
like build up the roller coasters and Ferris wheels and stuff. I loved it. This bastard. Uh, because get too expensive way too fast, yeah. Hot Wheel collection? You're into cars? Yeah. Hot Wheels are expensive too. So I, I know what you're saying. Like, I've seen some of the cars. Go for a crazy amount. I've just tried to, like, stop collecting everything, pretty much. Like, all I want to do is uh, finish my amiibo collection, that's it. Um, but I also collect uh, Steam games. And I have an unhealthy obsession with collecting Steam games. Which takes my money. Focus on one at a time, yeah. Oh, collecting. It's a... Uh... I mean, it seems like everybody has a collection. You know. Everybody has a collection. So everybody kind of knows. The struggles. Yeah, there we go. I was waiting for that. Well, like, at least collections hold value, you know? Most of them. Like, Funko Pops don't really hold value. I pity the fool who uh, collects Funko Pops. Cause goddamn, there's so this. many, and they're so expensive, and they resell for nothing. They mass produce the shit out of those, yeah. Yes, they do. All I have is the uh, Jurassic Park Funko Pops. That's it. Because I love Jurassic Park. <laughs> Plus they were dirt cheap, of course. Uh, yeah, we'll go Evening Star. There you go. Yeah. But yeah, I checked how much money... Why did I leave the quest? I checked how much money I spent on uh, Steam overall. It's a fucking way, way unhealthy amounts. <laughs> and I kind of regret it. I haven't seen a Funko Pop that I would be interested in so far. This doesn't appeal to me. Yeah, they look kind of weird. They do look weird. Um... So I don't blame you there. I don't necessarily like how they look, but like, I'm not, I don't really hate it. So it's like, if I find a really dirt cheap figure of a good uh, Funko Pop, then maybe I'll buy it, you know?
Okay. Nothing wrong with that. Alright, thanks, Dads. I appreciate you stopping by and chatting. Uh, rest for work tomorrow. Damn. Sunday work. I'm sorry about that. Well, good luck with that. <laughs> but yeah, have a good night. Thanks for stopping by. A car dealership? Oh, nice. That's a nice job. <laughs> nice. All right. Have a good night. I appreciate it. that reach no <laughs> come on Fuck. Oh. it's gonna be annoying without any gunners that dude just flashed his ass I should make a heavy bow gun set. I think I might want to do that. That'll be fun. Somewhat. Gunning is fun every once in a while. But I can't do it all the time. Gotta make the uh, Fatalis heavy bow gun. Because that Shrek's uh, Tiastra. the roaming Batista. Is it even? Okay, it is. Oh my god, that damage. Holy shit. That's some good damage. Welcome to Chili's. Finally a shout out that's not about like some innuendo for melting the monster. I was gonna say. Get fucked. It's kind of a big Tiastra. Not Gold Crown, but like... Meh. These people do not know they have blast plate. They're gonna blow me up. Nice. Hey, what's up, Loki? 
What's up? Not much. Not much. Just playing Monster Hunter. How about you? What's up with you? I set up a multi-stream, so I'm streaming on Kick and YouTube as well. I want to see how that works out. Am I into monsters? Why? Well, I'm into hunting them, you know. Oh my god! Am I gonna die? See, I use Restream and it doesn't allow uh, Grinder and PH, sadly. Maybe I have to pay extra for that. I don't know. Oh. I probably am missing out. <laughs> Look at all like the Minecraft videos on Pornhub. It's insane. Oh, suck it. I just broke his wings. Nice. Furries would go crazy. I'm sure they would. Okay, like, you look on Pornhub, there's, like, a video of Minecraft. And it says, like, Guys, how do I tame a horse? And then all the comments are just helpful. It's insane. It's, like, the best platform to stream on. Oh. Let me set this off. I, I have to reload it? Where do I get the fuel? Oh, is it like down here? I think it's down here. No, this is the binder. Uh, I don't know. Max Verstappen won in Saudi Grand Prix. I'm so depressed. If you're depressed about that, you might want to see a therapist. <laughs> Cause fuck. That's like when people like... Break TVs because of football and stuff. Verstappen's the only name that I know in NASCAR. Other than like Bobby Labonte or something. Nothing will stop us. If you were rich. That's a big if. I mean, if you're rich, you could have rigged it. Verstappen is in NASCAR. <laughs> okay. Listen, NASCAR and Grand Prix bullshit, it's all the same to me. It's all the same to me. Watch Merkin beat him and his prime is over the- I don't fucking know. I don't do no racing. Listen, car driving, every car driving sport is in one category for me. All right. F1 cars are really different than NASCAR. I'm sure they are. I'm sure they are. It doesn't matter to me though. They're all racing in a circle. Uh, let's see, I don't even know what I want to do. 
NASCAR is full of Chevys. Cool. Cool. <laughs> Guess I'll do more Tiastra. In an ellipse, F1 has real tracks. I've... I have yet to see a real track. Listen, you could like whatever you like. I don't know how people can watch cars go in a circle for like 200 laps. Shit's insane. Me up when they do bumper cars or something. NASCAR is 500 and F1 is 58 or yeah. I mean it's the same thing. I still don't know how that's even fun to watch. <laughs> like I said, there's nothing wrong with it. Not for me. I don't need to watch car- I already have. My stepdad's really into it. He loves NASCAR. He has NASCAR on a lot. It'll reignite your passion. It was never ignited in the first place. That's not kinky. I don't know what you're saying it's kinky for. That's kind of weird. This is why people think you're a bot, alright? I'm just gonna say it. No, it's not. You don't have to make everything fucking weird. Oh, that damage. Sorry that I get two Christmases, alright? Got two sides of the family. Let's talk physics then. I'd, uh, I've never even taken physics. Philosophy, alright. Alright, let's let's hear it. Let's hear your great questions. Oh my god. Can change exist without time or time without change? That's a very vague question. Because what constitutes uh, change? You know? Like the change of a singular atom? Or something? I don't know. If time were to freeze, does stuff change? Not really. It's all the same. Change of everything. I'm dead. I'm not dead. Change of it. No, because time is how stuff marches forward. You know? Uh, time without change. Yes. Time without change, yes. Change without time, no. Because time without change... I mean, stuff doesn't have to change, you know? Uh, change is... Okay. I mean... Kinda. Time never existed when you grow up still. No. Because then 
nothing would move forward. Time is like a is like a abstract thought thing. <laughs> like it's not like physical evidence stuff. Time is pretty much change. I guess in a way. What's this? Oh my god, that's a good fucking decoration. <laughs> Crit boost evade window. That's like my first rarity 12 decoration. Nice. Uh, so back in like 23... Maya? Where Homo habilis existed, aka your ancestors, you didn't have time. A million years ago, okay. Yes, time is a concept. <laughs> That's like saying that people back then didn't have oxygen because we didn't give a name to it. You know? My achy bracky heart. So time is a concept. Yeah, it's an abstract concept. Um, but it's also kind of a reality because like Time is what moves us forward. You could you can manipulate time. You could like slow down time and speed it up. You know. Ooh, I'll take that quest. Brand new brute. Nobody ever fucking posts this quest. Somehow, like for some reason. Nobody posts this quest. And it's a really fun quest. <sighs> oh my god. I just realized it's... I just fucking realized it's spring forward, so now it's 3.30 in the fucking morning. It went from one- it went from two to three. God damn. Shit's dumb. How can time be different in different planets? That's what I'm saying. Um. Einstein's relativity space equals time. Yeah. Uh, it could, like, it could be both, alright? It's a concept and it's also a thing you can manipulate. Because what actually happens... Um... So like if you, uh, it's a concept, if it's a concept, how can a concept depend on something universally true, aka change? I, I don't know what you're saying there, but... So if you go into a black hole, I think, I think it's time slows down, it either slows down or speeds up. Is that time though, or is it just the atoms? Is it just the atoms doing their stuff quicker, you know? Yeah, you can manipulate time. Kinda. Uh, 
Adams had nothing to do with time, but rather change. I, I. Okay, what? Okay, if you go into a black hole, time is like speeds up. How does that speed up? Probably. Now, this probably hasn't been proven or anything, but it makes a lot of sense. Probably atoms do their stuff faster. They create bonds, they f fucking, you know, flow faster and stuff. And that's what causes, like, time to change, quote unquote. And the atoms changing is what we perceive as time. And that time is a concept. It's a concept weighted on like science. I remember it speeds up, slow down. Yeah, neither do I. What's defined by gravitational pull? These black holes are the densest things in our universe. It slows down time. Yeah. Yeah, but saying like it slows down time. The time is just a concept. So what does it actually do? And I'm saying it probably uh, messes with the atoms differently. Man, I'm gonna sleep in until like fucking 5 p.m. tomorrow because it went forward an hour. What kind of investigations are there? Uh, nothing. Man, why are people not doing investigations? If it's a concept, how can it affect change differently? I don't. I don't even know what that means, but okay. I don't know what that means. We're getting too abstract, all right? Too abstract, we gotta bring it back. Back to NASCAR, oh god. <laughs> Just remember, all right? It's better the, to poop in the sink to, than to sink in the poop, all right? That's all you gotta remember. Is this a NASCAR you driving really fast? That was a sentence made by like the, the fucking homo habilis 23 million years ago. Oh, I want to tenderize first. What song? Oh shit. He's dead. He's not dead. He survived. Yeah, bitch, get staggered. Is it a, is it the lyrics to a song? I've never heard that. Is this a NASCAR? Are you driving really fast? It's a NASCAR. 
That's where they got the name from. That's a real NASCAR. Some rednecks. It's a nasty ass car. They say NASCAR in Jersey. I, I think it's like more like a redneck thing. Maybe Jersey, I don't know. I guess I don't know the Jersey accent. Where I'm from, it's like, uh, oh yeah, that's a nice car, eh? That's, that's the accent from where I am. Oh yeah. The Uber accent. Canadian, yeah. Pretty much. Sorry, eh? Yeah. I don't have the accent, even though I lived here my whole life. A boot. Yeah. Say ya yeah to the UB, eh? That's it. I can't even do it right. It's because we have like a lot of Swedish and Finnish heritage as well up here. This dude's like almost already dead. <laughs> nice. Look at these long sword users. There we go. Material. Uh, I'll take that. I'll take that. Oh fuck yeah! Elder Dragon Gym. All right, where's this? How do I? Where's the ammo for this? Is it like over here? What are my plans? I mean, that's kind of vague. Like, what ki plans for what? I could have sworn it is here. All right, let's shoot it. Can I shoot it? It takes so long to reload. Tomorrow? Uh. Do fucking nothing? It's Sunday, so I'm doing nothing.
I'm doing as much nothing as I can. Other than streaming. Only dead people can do that. I'm pretty much dead when I go to sleep. It's so cold. It's so cold. Ugh. Events. What kind of events we got? Rotten can zone? Maybe. Do I feel like doing that? Hmm. Sure, why not? Why not? What are my hobbies? I mean, video games. Video games, movies. Uh, just hanging out with friends. Um, sports for fun, I guess. Actually, I don't even need to do this quest. Oh shit, other than that. Pretty much just, uh, yeah, hanging out with friends. Friends and family. Just having fun, you know. Not much, just uh, like to hang out with people. Basic NPC hobbies, I mean, they're fun. It's fun. How, how is hanging out with friends basic NPC hobbies? When like all the neckbeards never do that, all the white knights never do that, stuff like that. I try to enjoy life. Beards are their own characters. They are. It's fun to observe them. <laughs> Why would I want to do this quest? <sighs> yeah. I mean, my days are like usually filled up anyway. My days are always filled up. I gotta take care of my house. I gotta take care of my dog. I gotta take care of uh, my job. Spend time with my girlfriend. Do chores. There's always some random shit that comes up that I have to take care of. You know? I usually like the, the time I stop my day is like 10 p.m. so it's already pretty much done except on weekends weekends are more open but what is my job um i'm a software like tester for a large um a large self-driving car company but I can't say which one, because apparently I can get in trouble for that, which is fucking stupid. Nice. Thanks. It's a job. <laughs> I'd rather be a software engineer, but you can't find those jobs anywhere. Software engineer does not have any open jobs fucking anywhere. Anywhere. Have you signed an M NDA? Um, kinda, yeah. I can't even put it on my resume, which is fucking bullshit. Like, I could, I could put, like, what I what my job is. I just can't put, like, the company name. 
and stuff. That's gay. I fucking know. Companies, like, you shouldn't be allowed to do that. It's so fucking stupid. Nice one, bro. It's based on the check. No, it's not. Or maybe it is. I can't say anything. For fuck's sake. I don't even know if it's like legal to have a job in China if I'm in the US. I, it probably is, I guess. It probably is. Just not for like big companies. But yeah, like it's a, it's a remote job, so it's easy. Well, it's like the job isn't easy itself, but the environment is easy. Plus, they gave me a really nice monitor that I get to keep. So, I'm happy about that. It's basically my dog. Yeah, she's she's a fucking asshole when I try to work. I, mean, I guess she's not the worst, but like, she just wants to play. And it's like, I can't play. Like the other day, uh, I was in a meeting, so I couldn't like be bothered by my dog. And, uh, she fucking ripped up my girlfriend's sandals. <laughs> so, that was great. Self-driving car, RC car for, for, from the company. I wish. I fucking wish. That'd be dope. She's just jealous. She is jealous of my girlfriend. Like when we lay down to go to bed, she'll jump up on the bed and attack my girlfriend. Like all out attack my girlfriend and I have to yell at her. Women. Women are awesome, all right? Women are amazing. My dog's name is Boog. B O O G. It's from the movie Open Season. If you've ever watched that. I love that movie. It's the bear from Open Season. I've received a hundred messages today. You're not that cultured. It's a fucking great movie. You should watch it. It's like an animated. It's like a DreamWorks movie. I haven't even watched Godfather. I I haven't either. So you're fine with that one. Um. But yeah, my dog also ripped up my girlfriend's uh, birth certificate. Like, a copy of the birth certificate, thank god. But... She didn't want her to exist, I guess. Yeah. That happened, like, last week. Um... What were... I forget where I was, but... Yeah, she was alone. And somehow got into a birth certificate.
One time we were at dinner and we have a camera that watches her. Calm your dog down. Well, she's a puppy. And that's what puppies are. She's a really good puppy. But puppies in general are all bad. <laughs> so. They all get into stuff like that. How you doing? She's, she's calm. It's just she gets like anxious or something because we're gone. Um. But yeah, one time we were out to dinner and we have a camera that watches her. So we can go on our phone and like watch the camera. And we see her go into the kitchen and take like a water bottle and go back into the living room and bust it open. And she did that like five times and the carpet was all wet. When we got home. But yeah. She's a good dog. It's just she has separation anxiety, I think. Um, which most dogs have. Drink vodka on the weekends. Yeah, pretty much. She's not old enough for that, actually. She's only 10 months, so that's, uh... Like six years old. Uh, ooh, fuck yeah. I love this quest. Ballad of the Horfrost Reach. I love this quest, but nobody ever uses it. Nobody ever takes it. My viewer average is like, it's still like 1.8. I mean, I streamed Minecraft the past couple days and I was the only viewer, so <laughs> for most of it. Yeah, I don't know. It's so hard to get discovered. I don't I don't really care um, to get discovered quick my bad I should it's not your fault Loki I, I appreciate you coming in like all the time stream is very uh, yeah yeah I understand like I appreciate you just com coming in and being here uh, whenever you can you know Some monkeys. Yeah, I don't know why you watch streams this early. It's insane. I'm too groggy in the morning to watch streams. You like to talk to me I appreciate that I hope you do because you talk to me a lot and ask you like what is God stuff like that nah but I like talking to you as well this is like the whole reason I started streaming is because I want to build like a a community to talk to and stuff you know it's like the f most fun thing about streaming. I'm bored. Yeah, I'm sorry. Is this gameplay not enough? I'm just kidding. Monster Hunter is kind of- it's a little boring to watch, I'll, I will say. It's kind of boring to watch. Especially because you don't play it. You don't understand it. I mean, you just take giant weapons and kill stuff with it. Like, I'm just killing stuff with a giant fucking sword. Right? That's the basic gist of it. Um.
You see on like the bottom, there's like... Elden Ring vibes? Yeah, that's what people say, but... I don't, I don't really get Elden Ring vibes from it. Because this is more... I, this is like a lot more environmental and like... Every monster has its own behavior. And its own... Style, I guess. Elden Ring is just a lot of like... This boss is here. This boss is here. And stuff like that. It's kind of weird. It's a lot more anime, yeah. Yeah, it is. Um, this is like the the non-anime game. Like the the other Monster Hunter games are a lot more cartoonish. This one was made more realistic. But you'll get you'll get anime vibes from the other Monster Hunter games uh, if I play them. Summer or winters? Um, I like summer a lot more. Winter has its charm, like its cozy charm. But in summer, I can go swimming, I can, you know, play sports outside. I can, like, fucking do whatever. I don't have to bundle up. I'm a summer baby. I was born in November. If that's what you mean. <laughs> Daddy, chill. But Where I live is like, I think it's called like the Snow Point Capital. Or something like that. Because we get an insane amount of snow. Like, insane. Um... You were born on the 21st of November? Were you actually? Guess what day I was. But yeah, the summers here are really nice. What? Okay, what year? Unless you don't want to say the year. The, 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 you don't have to, you know. 2000. So you're 23. Alright. Guess what day I was born on? In November. Nah, but the, the summers here are fucking awesome. I was also born on the 21st, you're right. <laughs> 1999 though. So That's kind of that's kind of crazy. A year apart. What a coincidence, yeah. It is a coincidence. It's uh or maybe we're soulmates. Maybe. Maybe. Maybe in a past life we were soulmates. Or something. It's a 1 in 365 chance. That was a nicely placed trap. Subnautica being our connecting link. Maybe. Maybe. People born on the 21st of November, like, somehow love Subnautica more. Maybe. Uh, uh. With that logic, yeah. Yeah. Pretty much.
But yeah, back to your question. Um, summers here are so fucking... They're so nice. The summers here are, like, perfect. You know, I live, I live on a lake. Um, it doesn't get too hot. It doesn't... Um... What is this thing doing? Okay, whatever. You know. Um... Love to go swimming here. There's not there's not too many people living here. It's a nice small town. If it, if, if it goes above 20 degrees, I don't know what that is Fahrenheit. <laughs> Cause it's like if it goes up above 100 degrees Fahrenheit, then I'm kind of iffy. But the winters here are absolutely terrible. Every day I have to snow blow. It's insane. Sixty-eight parent really? That's it? Bro. My house is set at like 72. If it goes above 100 Fahrenheit, then it's too hot. Walk back home from university and I love the cold. You're different. You're a different breed. Alright, let's get him up here. It gets so cold and dry here that my hands bleed. Like, I'm not kidding. My hands... profusely bleed. Because they crack and stuff. Like, I don't know if you could... You probably can't see that, but... Cause it's kind of healing right now. The temperature is negative like 14 degrees Fahrenheit. Yeah, that's cold. Apply some gel. I fucking do. I do. All the time. It doesn't work. I've tried different brands, I've tried everything. It's just a thing that I have to deal with, I guess. I don't know if it's some kind of like... Disability in some sense, or like if there's some something wrong with me. Like maybe my circulation's bad? I don't know. But it just doesn't work. Must be a Swiss thing that you like. Maybe. Probably. I mean. That is. Their shtick. They do like the cold. Women shed skin. Uh, when they're on the periods. Maybe you're. Probably. Maybe I've been on my period. My whole life. But yeah, like, if it was just the cold, I wouldn't mind it, but the snow that comes with it is fucking insane. I don't mind cold, I just don't like snow. I don't like so much snow where I have to shovel every day. Uh, 
when it's melting because you can barely walk. I know. It's all slush. I hate that shit too. I hate when you have to walk in the slush and like it gets into your sock or something. Or it gets into your shoe. bastard doesn't want to sit still oh god that's the edge of the map I'll take a power cone fuck it uh, in 2013 it was all snowing and it fell down like seven times <laughs> yeah When I was in college, I would see people like slip and fall all the damn time. It was kind of, it was kind of funny, but also not not funny at the same time, you know. Oh my god. Legs are so bruised up. Yeah. Winter is a vibe. Um, it's just I enjoy summer more, you know. I love like October-ish when it's like, you know, autumn and like kind of cold but still kind of warm at the same time. Perfect temp. Have I ever been skiing? Um, I've tried skiing, uh, but I like snowboarding more. Come on, bro. Set up a trap down there. Oh, fuck yeah. Dude, where's the whole team? Thank God. Emerald? Nice! I need those. Some Sky Emeralds. Um, I have, I have skied. I didn't like it. I like snowboarding a lot better. Um, but yeah, I, I just, I used to snowboard, but I don't really anymore. I live at the bottom of a ski hill, so... I can go whenever I want. Just not right now. Is there really a big difference? Kinda. Kinda is. Just how it feels, I guess. 
I don't even really remember how it feels to ski. I just know that I didn't like it. <laughs> so, so I don't really care. It's like, it's just so... It's, there's so much you have to do to fucking go snowboarding. <laughs> I don't feel like doing it. Like, you gotta buy the right equipment, you gotta go to the ski hill, you gotta fucking sign up at the ski hill, you have to go up and down the fucking hill, all that shit. It's like, that's like a fucking five day adventure, you know? There's so much to do. So much you have to do to actually ski. Where is this bastard going? Do I believe in ghosts? No. I don't. I don't believe in ghosts. That's the, like, if there's ghosts, that means I pretty much conclude that there is God, in a sense. I've had my fair share, yeah, I have had my fair share of supernatural experiences. Um, but like, I feel like that could be explained by like physics, you know? And I haven't seen any evidence, like online. Like the biggest supernatural experience I had was a blanket just being ripped off of me when I was sleeping or when I was like going to sleep um, but who knows maybe I was like hallucinating or something I don't know do you have any Loki any supernatural experiences any ghost that's it yeah that's, that's like, I mean, it was like a quick ripoff. So I don't know what you're saying, that's it too. All right. I've had stuff like stuff falling down, you know, as well with nothing around it. You wish? Demons everything the whole package. Fuck. Get a get a Ouija board. Try it out. But no, I feel like everything could just be explained in some other way. Oh my god, is that a gold? I don't think it is, but I'm gonna catch it. No, it's not. <laughs> There's no way it is. No. But, uh... The online Ouija board. <laughs> well, you gotta buy one in real life, right? Just have your hands up to the monitor. Oh! How big is your PPE? But I do believe in aliens. Need to buy the premium island. No. Like a, like a physical Ouija board. I believe in aliens, I just don't believe that, like, they've ever come into contact with us. Haven't aliens been proven to exist in the US court? I don't think so. I feel like that would have been, like, a big headline, right? I've never heard about that.
like with every like the billions and trillions of galaxies and planets and stuff there's gotta be i'm not saying like standing green guys you know i'm just saying like maybe like a single-celled organism or like a bacteria or something or a little isopod you know on some other planet I really hope in my lifetime space travel gets gets like furthered you know so far to get to earth though yeah i know Ooh, two crowns nice i don't know if if aliens were, were good enough to like fucking get all the way here to Earth? I feel like they would have enslaved us or something. If they're that smart. Isn't Blue Origins giving tickets to peop to get people into sp I have no idea. I haven't heard about that. I don't want to go to space. I'm not going to space, fuck that. Ain't for me. Only rich fucks buy it. Yeah, it's like the Titanic sub submarine. It's a round trip. Ooh, fuck yeah. It's a round trip. Yeah, okay. I don't- I really don't understand the fucking submarine thing. Like, why would you want to go down there? If you, you have like a tiny ass little peephole that you can't even see anything out of. Those people were idiots. If aliens enslaved us, we would need a Master Chief. Yeah. What about Master Chief from Halo? He's probably a good- Nah. Who- who would be? The Master Chief. Who do you think? Oh god damn. It's a big one. Chris Hemsworth? Okay. Can I be honest with you? I don't even know who the fuck that is. I've heard his name all the damn time. I just don't know who that is. Oh, Thor. Okay. Yeah, now I know who that is. I like- I'm very bad with like actor names. You know. Who would I vote for? Um, I have no idea. Like, Morgan Freeman. How about that? He's like the most neutral person I can think of. Oh god. Oh. He'd negotiate with his voice. Yeah, exactly. That's what I'm saying. Like, nobody hates him. I don't think.
Or what if Jesus Christ gets res resurrected or something? And Doomsday is here. Yeah, that's true. Well, I mean, if the aliens did come down, that would be Doomsday, kinda. Maybe that is the Doomsday. Is aliens enslaving us. Oh god. Tombsay battle would be insane. Fuck yeah. It would be cool, but I also don't want to die. You know? It's like zombie invasions. The biblical god knows how to make a battle sound crazy cinematic. Hell yeah. Ain't that the truth? Average life is 80 years? Yeah. Well. I don't know, I feel like the average is like a lot higher than that because doesn't that 80 years take into account um, like third world countries and stuff? Maybe. Who the fuck knows? I think they're like working on a on a fucking treatment to make dogs uh, live like five years longer. I think I read that somewhere. Probably yeah. for cats so I thought it was dogs I don't know maybe it's both hopefully but it's like if they could if they could find stuff to do that why can't they do that for humans like that that's uh increasing the dog's lifespan by like 33 percent you know that's a lot Cats are bullies, I know. I fucking... I, I don't like cats at all. I don't like cats, all right? I said it. We used to have a cat, but it was just a fucking asshole. So we, we gave it away to somebody else. They're just so annoying. They just... Dogs for... Thank you. Thank you. Somebody that gets me. <laughs> dogs are so much better. They're, like, cats are so annoying, they just fucking, they find shit to piss you off. They'll rip up something, you know, and then you yell at them and they don't even, they don't learn. They don't learn. They, they If you yell at them, they just think that you're a bad person, you know. Not that they did something wrong, but when you yell at a dog, they know they did something wrong. It's like cats are mostly untrainable. Can't train cats. I don't care what people say. You can't train cats. Oh. 
No, they don't feel guilt. They don't feel guilt. That's... You're right. Dogs are so fun and so cute. I know. They really are. They just have so much energy, you know. And all that energy is just, like, put into, like... Like, love, you know? Except for, like, pit bulls. Pit bulls don't really... Uh, or aren't really the greatest, I will say. But no, every every dog that I've met in person has always been a love machine, you know? Every cat I've met is a fucking asshole. People are like, oh, oh, my cat was meowing at me at three in the morning and it was waking me up oh it was so cute it's like what the fuck that's not cute that's fucking annoying as shit it's the crazy cat ladies never owned a dog but my uncle owned a great dane and he was like double my height yeah great danes are massive but yeah whenever you get your own place you get a fucking dog Get a dog, but but when they're puppies, they need a lot of attention. They're like babies. So, you know, only do it when you have the time. Ooh. I want one more hunt. Should I try this? I'll do a Fatalis. I'll do a Fatalis. I would have to breastfeed the puppies. <laughs> I mean, you could try. You could try. Tell me how that goes. I want to know. Uh... I wish we could change what, uh, what liquid we could put for breastfeeding. Like, imagine pumping out Dr. Pepper, alright? That shit would be insane. Get Dr. Pepper transplant or something. Would be out of business. <laughs> I'd be sucking on titties all day long. If they had Dr. Pepper, goddamn. You know that's me. You don't like soda? That's fair. That's fair. I I really like soda. I'm trying not to drink it as much because it's pretty bad. Um, but I kind of grew up drinking soda. I don't know. I like soda. It's just... It's a lot of acid, you know? And I, uh... I applaud everybody, everybody who doesn't drink sodas. Don't see how I can replace water. Yeah. For some people. 
I know what you mean, yeah. People that drink soda all day long. That's disgusting. That's disgusting. Like, I used to drink one can a day, that's it. Just one can. Um, now it's like one bottle every three or four days. I'm trying to drink less. No, but I love drinking water. That guy just fucking died already. I love my water. Just forget to drink. Yeah, me too. Me too. But it's like people say you need like you gotta drink this much in a day. You don't have to. It's just whenever your body feels like it needs water, you drink it. Right? That's how much you should drink. Uh-oh. Oh god. That's what you think too? Yeah. You don't have- there's no quota on water. Just drink when you're thirsty. That's what your thirst receptors are for. But now, I drink a shit ton of milk. I drink like half a gallon of milk a day. <laughs> That's kind of my, like my go-to drink, is milk. When you're thirsty, uh, drink an entire of your water bottle? Yeah, me too. Like... Those times when you like wake up at like 3 a.m. and you're just insanely thirsty. Yeah. I know what you mean. Why is everybody fucking... Oh. You hate milk? What? I drink that shit straight up. Oh, fuck. The color of it, you know, just like white milk. I've never heard about that before, but you know, if you don't like it, you don't like it. Nothing wrong with that. The roaming Batista. Oh shit! I can't go without milk. Yeah, I drink chocolate milk as well. Oh my god. I'm stuck. I drink uh, regular milk and chocolate milk and orange juice and water and tea. That's that's my those are my main uh, drinks. Oh fuck.
white milk and all things white. Yeah, I drink white milk. I drink a shit ton of white milk. Curd and shit. I mean, yeah, it's not for everybody, of course. Not for everybody. If you don't like how it looks, if you don't like the texture, you know, that's how I am. If I don't like how it looks or the texture, I won't eat it. <laughs> White shit makes you want to throw up so hard. That's weird. To each their own. I don't know. I like how it how it, <laughs> it's kind of weird, but I like how it looks. Oh shit! I somehow went under his head. What other, what other white shit, uh, white foods are there that you don't like? I don't like like brown colored food. Like gravy? Fuck no. Fuck that. Oh. Doesn't work on chicken. <laughs> Damn. Oh. Damn it. I don't have fucking pods. God damn it. Dude, this guy has died three fucking times. He's gotta get his shit together. And he left the quest. He's too embarrassed. He left the quest. guy dude the people that join this quest this monster is the hardest monster in the game kind of people don't know how to fucking fight him and i say that and i'm probably gonna die here i think i might die here can i far cast her out i can't far cast her out i'm dead God damn, he closed the gate on me. <laughs> Motherfucker closed the gate on me. This bitch. That's okay. They just haven't spent enough time. Well, the thing is... Something's happening to it. The thing is, they only play multiplayer. Like, those people only play multiplayer, so they don't, they don't know how to fight them. Because other people carry them. Um, I fought this guy and killed this guy solo, so I knew how to fight him, you know? Let 
no, there's there's people that just um only play this game multiplayer and get carried the whole entire way because they don't know how to play the game. They never want to learn. Oh god. Really? I missed my fucking attack. Oh my god, that was a good fucking head break. At least these guys are really good. These other two guys. They know how to play the game. Oh shit. What's my favorite monster? Um, it's not in this game. It's a monster called Godmazios. It's a giant oil dragon. It's it like um oozes oil and stuff. Um. But yeah, <laughs> it's called Gogmazios. It's amazing. I love it. It's like it's humongous. It's covered in oil. Wins all in all dragons. Yeah, it's it's a dragon game, you know. There are like insects. There's spiders. There's there's like amphibians. There's all kinds of monsters, but like the end game monsters are all dragons pretty much. For the most part. Which I'm fine with. I'm fine with that. Dragons are cool. In this game, I think my favorite is Fatalis, which is this one. Um, he's really well designed. Oh my god! Oh. I barely escaped that. I'll show you Gogmazios after this fight. I... I... Did I watch Dune? I watched the first part. I didn't watch the second yet. I don't know if I will, because I don't even remember the first part. It was all a bunch of just talking. <laughs> Did you watch it? Oh my god. I watched the first part and my girlfriend and I were the only people in the movie theater. Which which kind of says something. Oh. 
Oh, okay. It's not that bad? Okay. I mean, the first part wasn't that bad, but like, it wasn't anything special, you know? I like the sandworm, but that's it. <laughs> what was it called? Like the Halud... Halud something or something? I don't know. Some sandworm shit. You talked about the first part too? Okay. Eh, it was okay. It was okay, it wasn't anything special. You haven't watched part two? Okay. So we're talking about the same thing. I don't know, it was so long. It was so long, there's so much talking, you know? Which, yeah. It's whatever. Just not for me. Oh my god. Papa. Uh, hold on. Story of Paul and how the houses and Emperor ship began. I'm sure, you know what? If it does well in the in the movies, they probably will do a thing like that. I'm, I'm not sure. There we go. They'll probably do something like that. If the movie does well. I don't know, it's just way too much talking, like, fucking... The first half of the movie was kind of boring, the second half was... It was kind of fun. When there was stuff that was happening. You know. Trying to come on. Timothy Chalamet isn't my favorite actor. He's not as good as DiCaprio. I don't know who Timothy is. I will say. <laughs> is that like the Dune? Don't you need sleep? Yes, I fucking do. It's 5 a.m. Where does the time go? I, the, it went forward an hour. Which is why, but... The main kid, that's what I thought. Here, I'll show you Gogmazios. And then I'm going to go eat a pizza and then go to sleep. <laughs> don't, don't look at this picture. Microwaving pizzas. No, I'm gonna. It's a frozen pizza. Um. Man, just give me a picture. Like, jeez. Oh. 
Okay. All right, maybe not there. Sure. It's like a big, humongous oil dragon that also ignites its oil. He's massive here. Let me see if I can find gameplay. Uh, hold on. Sure. By Deus. But this is American not business is made to work the way small business in works. any way, shape, or made form. Award winning security the biggest monster made to connect and protect every device. This monster is still made pretty small in comparison to others. Your business. Spectrum business made to work. Every part of you is connected. So the way you care for your health should be too. Whether you need primary care, mental health support, or care for chronic conditions, Teladoc Health brings it all together to keep all of you healthy. Get started today. All right. Fucking. The time has come. An all unknown right. That's how big he is. <laughs> he drips oil and shit. Thank you, tell the Yeah. Yeah, you gotta use like siege weapons and stuff and This is this is a 3DS game. This is Monster Hunter 4 Ultimate. Monster Hunter 4 was on the 3DS. Which wasn't the best, but it still worked. Um... This is one of the biggest monsters in the game. Dalamadur. It's a gigantic fucking snake. It is humongous. If I can find a video. This is also on the 3DS. How big of a fanboy? The fucking biggest fanboy. I am the biggest fanboy. I've played them all. I've put thousands of hours into like many of the games. My favorite series ever. Biggest monsters. He's fucking huge. He was a bastard to kill. But yeah. Probably time for me to go. I had to fight that IRL. There was like a there was like a shitty sci-fi movie called I think it was like Piranaconda or something. It had a snake this big. <laughs> and it was kinda it was kinda funny. Yeah, Loki, see you later. Have a good day. I appreciate you sticking around. I'll stream tomorrow as well. Uh, but yeah, have a good day. Bye!